Hey guys, it's Reza MC here, and I'm going to show you how to get an object dock today. Basically, all you need to do is go to wincustomize.com. I'll leave the link below. You go to Explore, Object Dock. Go, Don't click on it. Just click Download once you get on the dot object dock. If you want to pay to get the plus version, you get more stuff like um, tap docks, multiple docks on at once in screen, ability to auto hide your dock, or more mouse over icons, effects, task grouping, system trace port, fly on menus, and hotspot activations. These are for the plus, it's 19. Twenty dollars, but the free one has the basic ones that like you usually use. So you just click download. I already downloaded it, and once you download it, you open the thing. It should look like this without the gear. You just double click on it. It'll come all the way in the bottom, and it'll interfere with your with your start menu. So what I like to do with my start menu, I just right click on my start menu to get started with it. And go to properties and just click auto hide the taskbar. Which as you can see right now my taskbar isn't, but where I where I um go to my start menu or my taskbar where it usually is, it comes up when my mouse goes all the way down. So I just auto hide the taskbar and once you open the object dock it should have it should have my my computer, the documents, my pictures, and some of the stuff you could already add for yourself. Like, as you can see, I already added mine. It'll have your internet, but you could delete the internet it already has and put, like, the browser you usually use, which is mine is Mozilla Firefox. So, and it already has WinCustomize.com on it. It has a recycling bin, weather, and everything. So all you need to do is go to configure object doc and um, just go to postings if you want it on top you just click this thing it's usually on bottom just change it to top or if you want left or right right here is the right and I usually like it on top and here are some stuff so you could get your object dock faster if you see mine's faster than yours or something. You go to effects. You if it's not already wide, uh, wide with how wide the uh, the zoom of your object is. It should be three. It's easier to see and doesn't it doesn't like interfere with anything else. On quality and smoothness, uh, you should. It's usually on recommended for you guys, but change it to very fast. And all you need to do is just do that. Click OK. Once you click OK, um, you should restart. But restart it after you're done with everything. Um, you could change the theme of your um of your you could change the color of your object dock also but uh, the, where you could go here but I made mine transparent like but like usually it's you it should look like this actually but I don't like the color of it so I just put it as my background or anything you can also change the thing of it so like it looks cooler or something Every time you change this, change it into another one. But if it's like this, I just change mine to transparent so it looks like it doesn't have it. So it's cooler. And once you do that, you just close it. And um, you restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, it should already come up by its own. Go on the saved settings that you want. And that's it. Um, I'm Reza MC. Make sure to subscribe and ask for any requests last time I showed you if you wanna get an animated background uh, and check out my other other video this is my second one as I promised on my first one I would help you guys get an object doc like I had 
And if you have any other things with, if you want to get, be able to change your cursors, anything you want, just tell me. I'll help you through it. And thanks for watching. And make sure to subscribe.